He is a young man who realized his dream in the eighth grade to become a Walt Disney World ambassador. So fast forward 13 years and his dream is now a reality. Rayvon Redding is the Walt Disney World ambassador for 2022-23. He is only the fifth black male to fill that role in Disney's 50-year history. So I got the chance to talk to him about what it took to get there. Well, thank you all so much for being here. Welcome. I'll see you around. Bye, friends. See you. See you. Hi, Jake. Hi, Frankie. Hi, Frankie. Why are you over here? I was like, Rayvon's here. Well, so my name is Rayvon Redding, and I am the 2022-2023 Walt Disney World Ambassador. Walk around Disney World with newly minted Disney Ambassador Rayvon Redding. My Disney celebrity is here. And it's like so walking much. around with a rock star. You I love your feet. a treasure. Thank you. you Everywhere he goes, it's so good to see you. People light up when they see him. How could you not be excited to see this guy? His energy and enthusiasm are contagious. So good to see you. You have a good one. Even on a rainy day. Hi there. How are you, friend? Wonderful. He brings his own sunshine. As a kid, he visited the parks a lot. These are my people. And had family members who worked uh, here. And my mother worked at the Emporium. My stepdad worked at Cosmic Rays. My aunt worked on Main Street. My cousin has been with the company 15 years. So I knew I was going to be a cast member. But in eighth grade, something magical happened in his classroom. And I turned and in walked Mickey Mouse and the Walt Disney World ambassador at the time. And it was in that moment that I was not only starstruck because Mickey was in front of me and in front of all my friends, but I felt this aura of magic. This is a picture from that day when Rayvon met Ambassador Clay Shoemaker. Look at the smile on his face. It's in this moment, Rayvon says, he realized Mickey and the magic could exist outside of the theme parks. And it was that day that I said, wow. I want to do that job. I want to bring this magic, that feeling that I felt, into the community and, and spread it to everyone else. But to get there, Rayvon said he knew he had to be more than a dreamer. <laughs> he had to be a doer. And he did. A lot. That I was an entertainment cast member and I got to dance in various parades and shows across property and even overseas in Shanghai Disneyland. Uh, I worked in the Magic Kingdom guest relations. I've worked with their guest experience team, enhancing that guest experience. And I worked as a VIP tour guide. As a tour guide every day when he came to work, he went to the ambassador lounge to find the emblem of the ambassador pin. And I would touch it and say, I will become the next Walt Disney World ambassador. Every day, I did not miss a day. He said it was during his final interview for the ambassador job, he felt a shift. But I remember standing in front of the big boardroom and it was with our president and all of the senior steering committee. And I remember telling myself, I'm meant to be here. I am the next Walt Disney World ambassador. Let me show them why. We were able to notify Allie and Rayvon yesterday. He learned the good news over Zoom. So I, I began to cry and I was like, are you serious? Is this a joke? Because I'm easily gullible. It wasn't. At 27, Rayvon is only the fifth black man to become a Disney ambassador in 50 years. Now he is walking confidently in the direction of his dream, the seed planted 13 years ago by a classroom surprise. He now hopes to inspire others to follow in his footsteps. It was Disney who said, all our dreams can come true if we have the courage to pursue them. Rayvon's next stop, likely whatever he dreams of. I believe in magic, I really do. <laughs>